late because yesterday was Boxing Day. But we thought, oh, can't be asked think of anything new to do. Why don't we carry on with Thimbleweed Park? Yay! So, uh, in that little blank box over there, in one second, you will see, obviously, because we can't play Thimbleweed Park without a... Yes. It's Nutty Cluster! Hello! Oh, how beautiful. Um, <laughs> so, here we are in Thimbleweed Park. And um, we're a little nearer to solving the, the murder. Almost. Perhaps. Who I'm knows? Very little. Um, so, you can see we're on the settings and we're ready to go. So what we'll do is we'll, uh, without any further ado, we'll crack on. I need to refresh her, you know. Previously on Thimbleweed Park, watch the other two episodes. That doesn't help me right now. <laughs> you need the refresher. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> oh, I thought you meant they need it. No. Oh, shit. <laughs> We're in big doo doo then. Alright. Let's load the game. Okay, oh, so. Okay. I've no idea. Can't give you a refresher. No idea. Uh, it's all good. Um but but here we are, look. We're on the um we're in the hotel. Yeah. And we need to go to the bloke's room. And I feel it's very possible we could be sidetracked with lots of other things going on. Yes. Um how is the audio of the game for you? I actually can't hear any of it at this precise moment in time, but I don't know if I should be able to hear anything. Um Okay. I could be four. There's a waterfall. I'm certainly streaming uh I'm streaming audio, but you're getting audio through um, Zoom, aren't you? I think so, yeah. Mm, no, I can't hear anything. But you could hear the music a minute ago. I could, yeah. Right. I think Zoom might be filtering out. You might think it's noise. Yeah, I think you're right, because when you're talking, I can hear something behind you, but when you're not, I can't hear anything. I have no idea what they are doing. Yes, now I can hear that. Okay, good. Okay. So? Yes. Um, should we check the notebook? Uh, we can. Okay. I'm just going to check where the woman is. Okay. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan. Right, so we haven't sent her down anywhere yet. Should we no. send her down to... Doesn't she... One of them needs to go to the circus, I can't even remember. Come to the circus, what's the hotel? Oh. I think we need her down there first. Yeah. Circus um. is down there, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know how you make them do it, though. Oh, there you go. So shall we just leave her here while we can go Absolutely. back to... Yeah. Blokey bloke. It's still showing December 1986. I guess they couldn't afford a new one for 1987. So, should we just go straight to his room? Yeah. Do you remember what floor he's on? That one. Okay. I do. Yeah. Because his well key done. card says. Oh, yes, yeah, 708. I didn't notice that when you hovered. Okay. Oh! Oh, oh you struggled with this last time. <laughs> I struggled? Well, you're in charge, yeah. That, no, the little man on the screen struggled. I knew what I wanted to do. He was the one struggling. <laughs> it's locked. Right. 
Oh, he's got one of those uh, bears. Yes, he has. Wow. Uh, you don't want to be in front of the camera, really, huh. do you? It's a passport. Um, we need that. Huh, it's a passport. <laughs> okay. We have picked up the passport. Yeah, that's what we needed from the room, because we need that and the photo, don't we? For the, the label uh, says Pilo Bear. I wonder how it got here. Hmm. In case of emergency, do not sue Chuck Edmund. <laughs> right. So, um, are we... Are we to believe there's nothing else in this room? I don't think there's anything for us at this precise moment in time. I'd be worried about picking things up because the Hotel Tron is on. They will know somebody's been in the room. Yeah. All right. But that bear must be significant at some point, mustn't it? Yes. Is it worth looking this direction? All the doors are locked. Have a look on the mezzanine. Yeah, I was just going to ask what M stood for. Ooh. Oh. <coughs> Should we go in the forward room? Mm, we can't. Oh. It's locked. Shame. Mm, does the mezzanine go all the way around? It doesn't look like it. No. No. Oh, well, that was a waste of a mezzanine. Yeah. Unless we need to go to the ballroom at some point. Do you have a quick chat with the sheriff Ooh. coroner? I, uh, my... Spidey Welcome sense. to the Edmund Hotel, most beautiful hotel abu You're in the tri Thimbleweed <laughs> Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? <laughs> you look awfully familiar. Have we met before? I don't believe a boo so. Well, there you go. Is anything going on in the hotel today? Nothing, Abu. Certainly not more cases of uh, food poisoning. Definitely not, Abu. <laughs> I'm going to check out your beautiful lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. <laughs> right, can we pick that glass up? There's some back here. Yeah. It's, it's <coughs> put lipstick on it. It's been lipsticked to death. I reckon that's going to be important at some point, and it saves us coming back. It's been lipsticked to death. Nope. Really? I don't feel like cleaning up after hotel guests right now. Yeah, fair enough then. Spidey senses were wrong. Right, we can't go off the edge of that screen. No, okay. Back to the town hall then, yeah? To use the Dubriatron. Yes. Mine's like not got a head. No thanks. What could be causing that? A mechanical malfunction wouldn't do that. Do we have to fix that before we get out? Looks like it. That wasn't malfunctioning before, was it? Nope. Okay. Um... Can you 
Can you access that computer? We maybe need someone else to make that work. Yeah. We do have that game disc, that um, a cartridge, but. Mm, I mean, it's an Atari cartridge, and that's not oh, an yeah. Atari, but. Okay. Maybe mm. I'm just overthinking it. I can't put it in there. No, okay. you're not. <laughs> um. Oh, I don't know then. Welcome to the Edmund Hotel, most beautiful hotel abu in the Tri Thimbleweed Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? What's going on with the front door? It does that sometimes, and everyone worries that the hotel's boo-hoo haunted. But it usually fixes itself at some point abu within a couple of days. How else may I be a boo of service? Oh. Um, so we, we switch? Can't Might as well switch to her. Switch to the lady. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I need oh, to leave can't. the chat. I'm going to check oh. out your beautiful <laughs> lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. Oh, no. Oh, we can't. Nope. Okay. Bastard. No. Okay. <coughs> Right, where else can we go then? The doors are closed. So we're in the lobby. Yeah. We've been the mezzanine. Should we go up to Penthouse? Start posh? Might as well. Oh, uh, that's weird. I swear I pushed the penthouse button. Must be broken. That's weird. I swear I pushed the penthouse button. Wow. Must be broken. We're only getting from floor one to seven. Okay. We need to go into seven then. That's where the room key is, isn't it? Uh, no, we've got the room key on us. That's what I mean. There must be something in that room. We don't really have any names or anything, do we? To... No, no, exactly. Oh, Frank? Was it Frank Gardner? Is that the person who died? Um, yeah, I wish I'd paid more attention when the guy was talking yeah. to the. Me too. <laughs> I think it was Edmund, wasn't it? Oh, was it? We can. Have, can we have a look at the um, passport? We haven't looked at it yet, have we? Yeah, it just said it. It's a passport. It's a German passport for Boris Schultz. Boris Schultz. That's the bloke who's died then. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. The label says Pillow Bear. The toy that can be turned into a pillow. <laughs> the Hoteltron 3000 seems to think this bed is made. Hmm. Chuck's reach extends everywhere in this town, even from his grave. I'm confused now. Yeah, I mean, it must be important that he says the um, Hotel Tron thinks the bed's made. Yeah, because they said that in the last one as well. Yeah, but how does he know? Well, yeah. And there's nothing else to look in out here. No. It's getting dark really out there bad. now. 
Say but again. I know this sounds really daft, but the only thing we've changed in year, apart from taking the the bear and the passport, is you switch the light on for the bathroom. Just wondering if that'll fix the electrics so we can get out. <laughs> Actually, it's drawers, I know. Nothing else. The I'm doors sorry. are closed. Hmm, I'm confused. Do you see we have a little heart cut in there that said G loves E? No. Missed that. Well, if you look at the buttons. Where? Oh, it's there. Oh, I see. Yeah. And there's some up there as well. Yeah. Okay. That looks like the map. Like X marks the spot. Yeah, but what's after it? What's the squiggle after it? And, and like again, road, are we sure. looking too hard? Probably. Words don't do it justice. Right. Because there's no one else to talk to down here now, really, is there? No Welcome thought. to the Edmund Hotel, most beautiful hotel abu in the Tri Thimbleweed Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? Do you know what happened to Franklin Edmund? Huh, I saw him, but I don't know, Abu, what happened to him. Funny thing, Abu, though. Go on. That same day, a man with a large nose, Abu, checked in and then disappeared. You don't say. That is an odd arena coincidence. What room did he check into? Oh, let me see, Abu, now. It was a Mr. George Michael. Yes. He checked into a room, Abu, on the fifth floor. I'd like that room key for our investigation. I'm not sure I should do that without a warrant, Abu. But since there's nothing to see there, I suppose, Abu, I can give it to you. Thank you. Finally. How else may I be Abu of service? I'm going to check out your beautiful lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. <laughs> the doors are closed. Well, oh, why does he them. have to say that every time? I know, right? He's an idiot. <laughs> well, at least that seems to be working now. Not to the penthouse. Oh, it was just that that was... It's only when you press the penthouse. Right, okay. It's locked. Exactly the same. <laughs> yeah. But no picture. Except, yeah, I was going to say the picture's gone. The Hotel Tron 3000 seems to think this bed is made. Mm. It's turned off. It's turned off. That gum appears to be the only evidence that Franklin was ever in this room. Oh, we need to pick that up then. Because that will have DNA on it, surely. I'm not touching that. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that doesn't seem to work. It's a circus flyer with a crazy-looking clown on it. Hmm, pretty good makeup, though. Hmm. 
It only works on hotel room doors. I don't know. No, I'm lost now. Hmm. I can't pull that. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm not touching that. Uh, no thanks. You get toilet roll? Use that? <laughs> yes, it's toilet paper, also known as toilet tissue. It doesn't work with that. Oh! So close. <laughs> I'm not touching that. Hmm. It doesn't work with that. I'm, I'm confused. Yeah. Oh. We can't even change either, can we? No. Which is annoying. If I was playing this on my own now, I'm Googling it. <laughs> really, we want a uh, more of a... If you're stuck... Where's the hints that we're about before? What uh, is? We could ring that number, the hint number. Oh! Oh, yeah, it was. Oh, 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 okay. I don't think that was the number. <laughs> was it? Was it not? No, I don't think it was. Oh, 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 oh. How did you remember Welcome that? back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? <laughs> you need a hint. <laughs> um, something for the hotel. Yeah. Yeah. What could be stopping you from leaving? Check out what's going on with the front door. Yes, we know that. Talk to the hotel manager about the situation. We have. Do you think if we kept asking him? Maybe. The hotel manager will give Ray or Ray as a key card for Franklin's room. Yeah, we've got that. <laughs> Go into the room, then exit the room again. Yeah. Oh, perhaps it'll be fine then by the time we get down there. Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, no, thank you. <gasps> oh, creepy. What was all that about? Why couldn't they see me? I'm dead? Hmm. Well, I guess that's probably what I deserve. About time you joined us in the land of the almost dead. Who are you? I'm Xavier, the head ghost, and I'm in charge of the ghosts. I run a tight ship. Everyone must pull their weight or face the penalties. What do you mean, pull their weight? Don't ask. Time to update the schedule for everyone to follow. Clara, you're on elevator duty. Don't let anyone get to the penthouse. I was just on elevator duty. No arguing. Now, Virgil, keep up the good work on front door duty. Don't let anyone in or out of the hotel. It's oh. about time the living started realizing who's really in charge around here. That doesn't seem right. That's irrelevant. New ghost, you're going to scare at least one person who tries to use the drinking fountain in the lobby. Okay, everyone to work. What are you waiting for, Clara? Clara. 
By the way, <laughs> your brother died. Chuck's dead? When did that happen? I'm free of Chuck's tyranny. That is, I know he would have come here to tell me off if he could. I wonder why this head ghost seems so bossy. I've got to scare someone? Hmm. Maybe I have special powers. Okay. okay. So, so now we've heard that. Yeah. Do we drink from the fountain? No, oh, maybe. That's weird. How do we know what's I going swear on I that? pushed the penthouse button. Must be broken. Did you try penthouse then? Do what? Did you try the penthouse then? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, floor 12. Yeah, so we've got a little bit higher now. Hmm. Uh, they're all the same graphics though. Yeah, yeah. And there's no dust. <laughs> okay. Mm. That's weird. I swear. Little kid. <laughs> I'm not talking to a grody like you. Uh, I'm not talking to a grody like you. you give him the bear? he liked it before, didn't he? Um... Ah. I thought we might get to talk to the guy. To the ghost? Yeah. Hmm. He's obviously not there at the minute, though, is he? Perhaps talk to the manager first. I thought the um, the ghost might scare the little kid because he's they're not friends yeah. anyway, are they? No. Welcome to the Edmund Hotel, most beautiful hotel abu in the Tri Thimbleweed Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? What's going on with the front door? It does that sometimes, and everyone worries that the hotel's boo-hoo haunted. But it usually fixes itself at some point of boo within a couple of days. How else may I be a boo of service? What's going on with the front door? It yeah. does that sometimes, and everyone worries that the hotel's boo-hoo haunted. So asking him repeatedly But it usually helping. fixes itself at some point of boo within a couple of days. How else may I be a boo of service? I'm going to check out your beautiful lobby. Hmm. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Something Abu. with that kid. Push. I'm not talking to a grody didn't like let me you. Push him. <laughs> I'm not talking to a grody like you. I'm not talking to a grody like you. I'm wondering if we show him the bear, if he'll remember. The bloke who's died. Come back, you little twat. <laughs> He's moving too fast, don't he? I'd rather hold on to this in case of a hug emergency. Fair enough. Oh. I'm really confused now, then. Oh, 
Oh, you're good. We need to interact with the ghost. Yes. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Ooh. Did we just get an extra playable character? Oh, yeah, he's good. We've got another game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. At least one of those is easy to do. We'll scare the kid. Mm-hmm. That tickles. Also surprisingly easy. The ele the elevator isn't on this floor. The elevator isn't on this floor. Mm. The elevator isn't on this floor. What? Median can't press the button. Oh, okay. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can Ooh, do what I need to together. do. Oh, Dolores, she's in the uh, elevator as well, isn't she? Is she? Yeah, look, that's her, isn't it? Oh, is that something? That's not Dolores. Dolores was the first game we played, the little girl. Oh, okay. All these names. You ought to be doing your job, scaring someone in the lobby instead of talking to me. You don't want to make Xavier mad. You ought to be doing your job, scaring someone in the lobby instead of talking to me. You don't want to make Xavier mad. Don't care about Xavier. I was wondering when the spooky part was going to come into it. Oh, hello. <laughs> that He's doesn't laughing. use electricity. <laughs> Get real. That's totally not the greatest. What's going on here, Abu? I better jet out of here. Oh, it's just the drinking Abu fountain. As long as it's not something serious, Abu, then I won't have to call our plumbers. Okay. Passable. <laughs> I'm surprised you had it in you. Time for another ghost meeting. Clara, Virgil, get over here now. Right. Virgil, good work on the door. That should do it for today. New ghost. Average first scares. Keep practicing. Clara, stay on elevator duty. I need some privacy. This is outrageously unfair. Why do the men get to finish for the day? Enough complaining. Do you remember what happened last time? All right, all right. Sorry about him. We don't know who put him in charge. Weird. <coughs> Okay, so he's gonna have to leave the building to get do the rest of the stuff on his to-do list. Yeah. The doors are closed. So the penthouse is where the ghosts are. Right, okay. And she's still at work. That's weird. That's why she has I to work. swear I pushed Now. So if the man stop, we can get out. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, 
call you when you're dust. Dust? <laughs> dust. Dust. So are these things we need to leave the hotel? Yeah. So... I can't... Oh, where was Dolores? We've played so many little games that I can't actually... Uh, I should imagine she's still in the house. What? Why can't I leave? I bet it's Xavier keeping me here in this stupid hotel. Yeah. Okay, so uh, we'll go do that first then. Sorry, but Xavier said no one could go to the penthouse. Xavier says talking on duty is not allowed. Also, I don't talk to new ghosts. Leave me alone. <laughs> Did you just click blow on it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Try to talk to Dolores. It checks to... Which would suggest we have to leave the hotel for that. Yeah. Get into the penthouse. Was that on there before? Hey. Was that on there before? Get into the penthouse. I don't remember. No, I don't think it was. Hmm. At least we can do this bit now, I suppose. It's a rusty old padlock. And it's locked. <laughs> Tickets, 25 cents. Okay. I remember when those dolls were all the rage. People would wait in line for hours to get one. There's a horn there, can we? It looks like a circus clown horn. Keep your panties on, I'm coming! Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. So take your dime store suit and good news pamphlets and stick them where the sun don't shine. <laughs> Pizza delivery for Ransom the Clown. You still there, Red? I thought I told you to f off already. <laughs> Ransom the Clown? I heard you know about a body by the bridge. Jeez, no foreplay, Red? You don't beat around the bush, do you? Not my style. You can ask your questions, Toots, but I'm not saying I'll answer. Okay. What do you know about the body by the river? What body? Earlier this evening, we found a body down by the bridge. We're investigating, and I was told you might have some information for me. Nah, I heard some sirens before, but I figured they were headed for the mansion mansion. That's where most of the f***ed up stuff happens. What weird stuff do you know about at the mansion? You want to find out about the mansion mansion? You're going to have to talk to some other idiot. I keep to myself and the town folk leave me the f alone. Oh. Hey, I'm not about to rock the boat. I don't pay rent here and I can't go anywhere else after my ex-wife took me for everything I had. Oh. We heard you don't get along with the locals. Given my creepy clown face and Paul Chant for abusive name calling, it's not made me a popular community figure. No. But I don't need the validation of these small town losers. I'm Ransom the Clown. I was on the Tonight Show. I'm great. Not a lot left. What do no. you know about Chuck? Chuck? As in Chuck, my factory is too good to make toys, Edmund? Didn't know the pompous well myself, but I knew his brother Franklin, weedy guy, total 
Scared to stand up to his big brother, even though the family business was in the crapper. Okay. How do you know Franklin Edmund? We were supposed to go into business together. My act was about to go bigger than Jesus. I was a hit on The Tonight Show. I was on my way to the top, so we figured why not cash in with a little merchandising. Franklin wanted to get the pillow factory into making toys, so it seemed like a good fit. Okay. Don't go anywhere. Oh, press the wrong oh, one. So <laughs> Whatever, Red. Not like I'm going anywhere, but you're not getting inside without a warrant. It looks like a circus clown horn. Oh, don't say it's a rusty back. old padlock. It's not coming back. And it's oh, locked. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh well. So. We need to go to the factory as well then. So we need to get the ghost of the Edmund Mansion Mansion. Yes. But we need to stop on the factory on the way. Oh. We need to get the ghost out of the thing first. Looks like it. Oh. We could be playing this game for ages. A month, I suppose, looks like it. <laughs> Are we slow, or...? I don't really know it's what the gameplay... Gate. No. ...hours are supposed to be. No. I mean, we, we do have to talk to... Dolores. Oh, so we need to go there as well, then. But we don't, there's nothing on there that suggests we need to go in here. It's a locked gate. Well, what the hell? Okay. Let's go over to Mansion Mansion. Dig in! What are you doing there? Oh, I'm just digging. Uh, uh, mostly holes. But then I buried them again, all neat and tidy. Digging! Dig Better in. ring the doorbell. Hello, oh, how can I help you? Federal agent. Know any great graphic adventure games? I'm sorry, this isn't a good time to chat. So, if you'll excuse me, I need to talk to my sister about the will reading before heading out. She's waiting for me in the library. Well, okay. Just don't leave town. Oh. Oh. I didn't know that ring the doorbell. I really can't talk right now. Still dealing with family issues. Maybe you can come back later. Okay, then. I'll be back. Right, that was all automatic, that. Yeah. Digging! Oh. 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 Digging! Dig oh, God, he's got a to-do list as well. Collect 25 more specks of dust. Finally, it's your calling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. What's uh, what? Where's where's little beeper? What is little beeper? Okay. Well, 
At least I tried. Okay. Get key to factory gate. <coughs> I have no clue what a little beeper is. That's just my eviction notice from five years ago. Every time that sheriff tries to kick me out, I give him hell, and he's afraid to come back. We can come out of this though, can't we? The yep. caravan. Yeah. Oh, we need something. It's my to... old trampoline. Brings back memories. Don't we? Give what? We need something to feed little people with. It's too heavy. I need to be higher to jump on it. <laughs> That's too far to jump from here. <laughs> God, he's annoying. That's too far to jump from here. That's too far. He climbs to back here. up the ladder. <laughs> no bad. Are those yellow things specks of dust? Oh, popcorn. Okay. It's a rancid kernel of popcorn. Little beeper loves this crap. There we go, then. That's what we need. I won't pick up some greasy, disgusting, inedible piece of popcorn if I can't put it in something. Okay. I can't leave the circus till I feed Lil Beeper. So we need a bag or some such. Yeah. It's a rancid kernel of popcorn. Lil Beeper loves this crap. That's where the midway used to be. Now it's my garbage dump. That's where the midway used to. That's where the midway used to. It's empty. The rats and I cleaned it out years ago. It looks like there's a bag next to it, though. There was. Well, that's one. Lil Beeper loves this crap. Okay, two. I can count. Almost <laughs> half full. Oh, he's so annoying. It's a full bag of popcorn. Where is Little Beeper? I don't know. I don't remember him at all from last time. <laughs> Good spot. Can't get through. No, oh, he's not listening to you, is he? Nope. You I probably can't. need the trampoline to get up on the stage. But you can't move it. Mm. Oh, there we go. Backstage entrance. It's a box with a crank on it. Use it. 
Pede. There's an inch thick layer of dust on it. Hasn't been used in years. <sighs> That's not gonna work. Besides, it's pretty rusty and filled with rat. Getting frustrated now. <laughs> Well, I think we've walked as far as we can left. Okay. We know what's in that trailer at the back there. Mm -hmm. the we can't there. get in it. Okay. That's what we need the um, trampoline for. Um. As yet unknown. <laughs> wow. Here you go, little beeper. Enjoy your crap. Lives in the microwave. Yeah. That makes beeper, sense. And beeper. he swears a lot. Beeper. Yeah. Okay. Right. Get key to factory gate. 23 more specks of dust. One got two. It's my specks of dust. I wonder if you can give them. Give him specs of dust from the other people, the ones you've been collecting. That's what I'm hoping. My yeah. official ransom the clown underwear. Haven't had time to wash them yet. <laughs> Meanest clown of 1977 and 1978. Ransom the clown. <laughs> Too bad the paint's wearing off. Uh. It's my sample official ransom the clown wallet. I hope to get a manufacturing deal when I'm back on my feet. It's a brand new wallet and it's empty. <clears throat> that slop tasted like crap when I made it last week. Maybe it's gotten better with age. The fly larva crawling all over it seemed to think oh. so. Oh, it's grim, man, grim. Hmm. Can't think of anywhere else around here to go. Push it though, and push it to that back thing. Because you tried to pick it up, didn't you? I don't know what we've got to gain from doing this, but... No, me neither. As far to the right as I can move it. I'll have to pull it to move it to the left. I need to be higher to jump on it. Oh, I want to punch him. <laughs> Control him when he's jumping to do anything, can you not? Know? 
No, I don't think so. It feels weird that we've got that extra trailer there that we can't get in. Hmm. That's as far to the left I can move it. They'll have to push it to move it to the right. I'm getting off this contraption. Yeah. Okay. I'm lost now then. Ah, uh, it was all going so well. <laughs> We've been everywhere. Yeah, there's nothing more to the right, is there? Just don't let you go any further, no. Okay. We've got to get the key from somewhere. That's what a midway used to be. Now that's what a midway used to be. Now it's my garbage dump. Hmm. So the temp, the, the trampoline, only will. Pushes or pulls between the two trailers. Yeah. So we can't move that. No. We can only move it left and right. Yeah. There isn't anything in here other than the doorway. Then oh oh. Oh. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> Looks like a rattle. What's, oh, what's that, that green doesn't seem thing to work. you picked up? Hey? What's that green thing you picked up? Anti itch cream. Oh, okay. So we can't get through that back. Looks like a rattle! Hole there. No, it says walk to doorway. Yeah. But it doesn't let him go through it. Okay. <coughs> can't, can't come through it the other way from the backstage. But then we. I can't get there from here. There's another way. There we go. <laughs> well, let's go backstage then and try it. You know where the cannon is? Yeah. Backstage. There we go. Not that that's helped us any. No. Can't get off there now, can you? Okay. Are we ringing, ringing, ringing the hint line again? <laughs> If you're giving me a way to cheat, I'm going to use it. Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? Oh, oh. none of them will work. None of them. Oh. Thank you. Goodbye. We can't stop playing with him at the minute, can we? Yeah. Oh, okay. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on. Okay, get face Tron report. We can do that now. We've got the stuff for that. Yeah. We need to go to the county hall. Can't jump there on the. We can. Yeah, we can. Whoop. What is that? Oh. 
Oh, I hate those feet. <laughs> I'm not putting my face in there. This is the identity report I've been waiting for. Okay, let's confirm this one shot. So it's only the blood one we need to do now, and we haven't, we haven't got any blood, have we? Take a blood swab from the body. Find a suspicious, I can't speak, suspicious item with blood on it. So, though, the ice pick, is that only fingerprints? Yes, yeah. I think so, I don't know. It's on the, um, the woman's got it, isn't she? Yes, she has. But we need um, a swab kit or something? Okay. Or, I mean, he's got, he's picked up tissue paper. This is true. But we have to get the two together to use them because she's got the ice pick. Yeah. He always has to tidy up after her. <laughs> right, there's not anything else in here for us to pick up, is there? No, I don't think so. get a key to the factory gates as well and she needs 23 specks of dust oh god there's one on the stairs but they're not where's the library oh uh, who knows in this place oh it's a speck of dust Where the hell have you been, Dolores? We're all here waiting for you so we can start the reading of Uncle Chuck's will. Take a chill pill, Lenore. I had to answer the door. It was one of those federal agents. I don't care if it was the flippin' Pope. And hands off the cute one. He's mine. Let's get <laughs> on with it, sister. I want to know what I got. Wait, I thought you said everyone was here. Where's the lawyer? I don't know. I thought he was coming with you. <sighs> oh, Lenore, you're useless. Has anyone tried calling him? Well, maybe if you hadn't left town and broken Uncle Chuck's heart, we wouldn't need to call the lawyer to read a will. This is all your fault, Dolores. Okay. Um... I think he had the lawyer's card, didn't he? The clown. He's got, that's his lawyer's card. Yeah, but we just need a lawyer, don't we? No, we need the lawyer with the will, don't we? I don't know. Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Peter doesn't want to talk to you. 
Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Ooh. Peter oh. is embarrassed to talk I'm to it. Um, you know what? Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Chucky doesn't want to talk to you. Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Leave Peter alone. Right. Chucky's been in our family for years. He's a good plant. It says, out of order. The sign says it's out of order. The sign says it's out of order. Oh. <laughs> There's a speck of dust out there. Yeah, that's what I'm going back for. <laughs> <laughs> so what was that machine for? This is Uncle oh. Chuck's Indextron 3000 library filing lookup system. It uses the spewy decimal system to catalog books. I don't need to find any books now. <coughs> it's my next lawyer's business card. Brad Bailiwick, JD. Le I can't open that. Brad Bailiwick, JD. Is that what he said? Yeah. It's not there, is it? No. Hmm. It's my next lawyer's business card. Brent Bailiwick, JD. Legal problems? Oh. We'll screw them for you. I'm in the phone book. He definitely screwed me. In the phone book. Perhaps Are we Brent? Are we Brad. mishearing? Yeah. It's my next lawyer's business card. Brent Bailiwick, JD. Legal problems? We'll screw them for you. Here we go. 2258. Hi there, this is Brant Bailiwick, JD. Do you have legal problems? Then you've come to the right place. I'm out of the office today, prepping for ThimbleCon 87. Try me later. Mm. Alright, it's not that then. Okay, we got off on the wrong foot. Let's try again. It's good to see you again, sis. It's been too long. And whose fault is that, sweetie? I'm certainly not the one who abandoned the family in their hour of need. Also, have you called the stupid lawyer yet? I want to get the will read and see how little Uncle Chuck left you. Hmm. Do you know anything about Dad's disappearance? Dad probably ran off to hide somewhere. It's amazing that Dad and Uncle Chuck were cut from the same genes. One a powerful leader, and the other, well, uh, spineless. Don't talk about Dad like that, Lenore. You're so cruel. It seems too much of a coincidence that we have a card of a lawyer. Yes. We need a lawyer, and yet yeah. we can't phone him. He's in the book, but... And he's highlighted in the book. But he's out of the city. 
He didn't say he was out of the city. He was just said he was busy preparing for ThimbleCon. Try him again. Would it kill you to help out a little? I wasn't the one who abandoned the family. I was always there for Uncle Chuck. So it's time for you to finally lift a finger and help out. Oh, gag me. All you were ever there for was a handout from Uncle Chuck. Oh, Dolores, I won't shed one tear for you when the will is read and Uncle Chuck left everything to me. I think we're done here. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Oh, she's an asshole. I thought that was Dolores talking then. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Do we have another lawyer's number somewhere? I don't know. Hi, Doug. What are you digging? All right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the grand lobby. Mostly holes, but then I buries them again, all neat and tidy. Okay, Doug. You're doing a good job. Ta, Dolores. <laughs> digging. It feels lonely without Uncle Chuck around. That looks like Uncle Chuck's journal. Ooh, can we have a look in that? Now he's dead? I'd have to pick it up first. Jackass. <laughs> um, let's look at the next page. We didn't learn to do that from number one. <laughs> Oh, you mean go back? This yeah. is the first no, page. No, 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 I meant let's look at the other pages. Yeah. Look how much of a gap there is, though. Entry 172, entry 248. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. So we need to find the manual then as well, in the library. Yes. <laughs> this game is just getting deeper and deeper. It's like a big fat rabbit warren. the coroner right wow. right I'm confused what about Mr. Ray's? <laughs> He's the male agent. Yeah. Who's not particularly an agent. Yeah. Oh. This is hurting my little brain. That's the why no. Why no, Willie? Why no, Willie? Yeah. Oh, and this is why he's why no, Willie. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh. Oh. Oh. Okay, so... Is the woman... Ray Reyes? Is she Mrs. Reyes? I don't know. Possibly. So we've got an AI somewhere. Yeah. Oh, we need to go in the basement. Oh, okay, so she is Mrs. Graves. This um, game seems a bit apt, the amount of AI stuff you've been doing lately. Yes, I know, right? <laughs> oh, she's out of my will. Oh, so he's got another journal somewhere as well, then. Looks like it. <laughs> Uncle Chuck was a strange and complicated person. <laughs> it's Uncle Chuck's custom built multi band oscilloscope with phase memory monitoring. It's a TX1138 tube in perfect condition. I don't want that. All right, calm down. It's a spare AT25 Arrestron tube. Very rare, hard to find. She does want that one then. When we go to get the Arrestron, it's going to say, oh, we need a tube. Uh, yeah, yeah, of course. <coughs> Yeah. It's a box, but it's sealed shut. You open it? Nothing in here but broken Tron 3000 vacuum tubes. Okay. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. <laughs> It's a strange device with a red button. Press the red button. It's a strange device with a red button. I don't know why Uncle Chuck never let me touch this junk. Nothing here of value. Uh -oh. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. His bed's not made either. No. Need to be a scene. Oh, we can get her to do the um, the tables, can't we? Because that's in her bedroom. Yes. Pretty dark in here. 
remember how to get into it. It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode binary messages. Okay. Right. Oh, we still need to find a bloody lawyer. Hmm. I don't need to find any books now. Actually, you do. <laughs> What's it called? Um. on the design i've added a to-do list sorry i need to do to the code you'd think you'd use the indexatron to find it but if it's hidden yeah. would it be indexed in the indexatron no don't write me no and these are all two point somethings yeah Oh, this you can go up then. Oh. <coughs> That's such a good idea, isn't it? The back is. Yeah. I like that. stumped for a minute to be honest I think the lawyer we rang is the right lawyer but perhaps we just haven't got the time in right on it maybe welcome back to the Hintron 3000 how can I help you we need some hints <laughs> oh look if you can find a hint you're looking for it's because you don't need to solve it right now. Do we need to go back to the hotel then? You reckon that's what it's saying? Well, that's the only hint it's given us. It's for the hotel or for an arrest. Yeah. Oh, we need blood samples, yeah. People around town mentioned seeing an item in someone's possession that was covered in blood. Did they? Yeah. We need a what was it? blood sample from the body, don't we? We do. People saw Willie's wallet covered in blood. Thank did you. you Willie's wallet? We did. Right. Willie won't give up his wallet. Yeah. Unless we give him the wallet that the clown's holding. Right. He specifically asked for one of those wallets. So, right. 
we're getting to an hour and a half. So next time we play... Okay, we'll be organised. You must it. remember. Oh, really? <laughs> Joking. <laughs> um, we must remember... Okay. ...that we need to do that wallet swap. Willy we swallow. A, a swab or of some description to swab the body. Yeah. Which the toilet paper might do. Yeah. So, have we got any any quick fixes before we go? I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on... I don't think we have got any of them. He can't do anything. No, I don't think we have. No. Okay. He can't get In... out of the building, but he needs to get into the penthouse first and be able to do that. So I think what we'll do is we'll leave it uh, here Good with plan. Dolores. Yes. And uh, I think we'll probably call yeah. it a night. Yeah, it feels more than four hours, 51 minutes. <laughs> Yes, it does. Um, so, oh, I don't know what to do now. Do we? Well, we're still during the Christmas period, aren't we? Yeah. So next, next Monday is Christmas. Is New Year's Day, isn't it? Um, it's New Year's Day bank holiday. Right. It's not New Year's Day, but it's just the second of January. The second of January. Yeah. All right, so let's say next we'll go back to Monday. Okay. And we'll say that Monday, next Monday night at 7 o'clock, we will continue with it. Okay. Then we will have to, during that show, decide... What to do next. What to do when we revert to normal scheduling. Yep. Because okay. if anyone's, if we've dragged anyone along for the ride, they won't be happy <laughs> if we stop. Me along. <laughs> I've dragged you along. I have. I'm sorry. It's okay. Um. So. So yes. Uh. Well, if if you want to carry on with the story of Thimbleweed Park, then uh, let us know in the comments underneath, and um. We'll see how long it takes us to complete it. Or we'll go back to reg regularly scheduled programs of spinning the wheel and seeing what crap it wants us to play. <laughs> One or the other. Um, okay. We might, if if people decide they want normal normal retro lounge, I think we might still play Thimbleweed, but as a separate, yeah, separate thing yeah, for additional so, episodes, yeah. bonuses. Yes. Yes. Uh, right, well, um, thank you for letting me drag you out of your Christmas slumber. It's been a pleasure. Uh, and for me also. Um, so, everybody, if you want to uh, email us, you can. Uh, it's retro at snugradio.co.uk. That's also the website, snugradio.co.uk. We're on oh youtube because you're watching us live streaming on youtube we're on twitch because you're watching us live streaming on twitch we're on facebook twitter tiktok and you know what we also have a discord and the discord will be linked in the video uh, uh underneath the video underneath just, just down there just down there somewhere um everywhere on the internet that we are we are a snug radio so comment share subscribe like ring bells do a little dance. Make a little love. Get down <laughs> tonight. Um, so, that's enough. That's enough. Uh, we'll be back next week with another episode of Slug Radio's Retro Lounge. Until then, I've been Matt. I've been Matt. Until uh, we've been uh, Slug Radio's Retro Lounge. So, goodbye. See you next week. Bye.